Hi everybody, so in this video I'm going to show you guys how to make your own miniature woodsy plates just like this. So if you want to learn how to make this, stay tuned. I'm going to start with all the supplies you need. So to make your miniature woodsy plates, you are going to need some cardboard and you don't have to use the fancy kind, I'm just using cereal cardboard. Um, some tacky glue or you could use regular glue, so you're welcome to use any kind of glue you want. A tracer. I'm just using this bottom of this like play cup I had when I was little. A pencil. Any pencil will do. You're going to need just some scissors to cut them out. You need a paintbrush, and you are also going to need um paint of your choice. I use acrylic paint, Craftsmart in white. So that's pretty much it. And now on to the tutorial. So you're just going to take your cardboard box and. I just cut out a smaller portion to make this easier for you guys to see. And you're going to take the, the side so you can see the lines more clearly. And you're going to take your little template, whatever you want to use, whatever shape and how big you want it. So you're just going to make lines all the way around, just like I'm doing. So my lines were pretty bad, but yeah. So to make the other one, you're just gonna pretty much fold it in half and then cut it out, but it'll be much harder to cut out. Or if you want to like the shapes to be nicer and more even, you have to take more time, but you're gonna have to copy another one. So for the sake of this tutorial, I'm going to fold it in half, just like this. And I will just cut the shape out. Okay, so I finished cutting them out, and it's really derpy. I haven't even followed the lines, but I'm just trying to make it really quick. So once you have both of these, you are going to just take these two, and you're going to put the little, like, the little, you know, picture back to back, and you're going to try to match them up so it will fit. So you're going to take your tacky glue, and... You are going to just glue the sides. So you're going to wait for the glue to set in place so it doesn't wiggle while you are painting. So... I'm done one side and I'm going to wait for it to dry and then I can paint the other. So now that I'm done both sides, I'm going to wait for it to fully dry and I'm going to cut off the excess if that bothers you and in my case it does. And I could also make the shape more defined if I want to. And that's pretty much it. So I'll get back to you when I'm done. Okay, so I'm now done. And uh, as you can see, I made it smaller. And the paint has dried. So, excuse my hands, I haven't washed them yet. So it's pretty much like this. And I actually like the brush strokes because in the end they look more like wood. So they appear more like woodsies. And they're pretty stable if you put two on. So these are basically just for miniatures and you can just put your miniature like that. And that's how it will go. And you could choose to glue it or like you know you could switch your items whenever you want if you don't want to glue it. So that's pretty much it. And that's my tutorial on how to make your own miniature woodsies. So thanks for watching. Bye.